Namaste everyone. <clears throat> Thank you for joining in this video. So first of all, I take this opportunity to wish all of you on uh, the auspicious occasion of Shani Jayanti. And without Saturn, life would be impossible on this earth. Okay, no matter how many bad things are said about Saturn, a lot of, you know, a lot of things are related to Saturn. It is the influence of our karmas being the ruler of the natural 10th and 11th houses in the Kalpurish chart. Okay, but then uh, I thought of making this video today to suggest a very simple yet very effective remedy that was that has been taught to me by my Guruji, you know, and this remedy needs to be done only on Amavasya. Okay, so if you're someone who is watching this video tomorrow, okay, which is past Amavasya, India time, that is, you can always, you know, you can always do this remedy on next Amavasya. Okay, so... Don't be fooled by the simplicity of this remedy because most of the great things are inherently simple. Okay. And uh, this is a mantra based remedy that everyone can do irrespective of their astrological combinations or the, you know, or whatever combinations you have in the horoscope. All right. So, what is the remedy? The principle behind this remedy is that we are trying to appease the five elements or the Panchamahabhutas. Okay, and what are those five elements? It is the element of fire, space, air, water, and earth. Okay, so these are the five elements that we have to, you know, we have to deal with, we have to work with because these five elements, along with the nine planets, they bring to us, they are the harbingers of our karma. Okay, whatever karmic issues that we have. Of course, we are all having karmic issues. The fact that I'm making this video for all of you is karmic. The fact that you are watching this video and I'm speaking to you through this medium, that is also karmic. So don't think that one particular thing is karmic and the other particular thing is not. Okay, everything is karmic. So uh, the underlying principle of this remedy is that we are trying to work with these five elements. Okay, and then there is the, there is another, you know, there is another mantra that I'll suggest for working with the ascendant okay so if you manage to work with these five elements the pancha mahabhutas and also your ascendant then your entire chart gets remedified that is the working principle behind this remedy okay so let's uh you know let's see what the mantras are okay i'll not reveal the deities behind the elements neither i will reveal the you know what the planets mean okay how the elements influence the planets that is for a longer you know that is for a longer discussion and that's a part of Siddha Yoga. Okay, but if you want to learn Siddha Yoga, you can always reach out to me personally uh, at the number that is shared in the description box. Okay, uh, now uh, the first element that we need to work with is the is the space element. Okay, is the space element. And uh, you need to do these mantras in this order. Okay, don't do these mantras randomly, otherwise they are not going to work. Okay. The first element that we need to work with is the space element. And uh, the mantra for that is Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Okay. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. That is the first element. Okay. The space element. Then we have to work with the air element. Okay. So for the, for the air element, the mantra is Om Namah Shivaya. Okay. Om Namah Shivaya. That is the air element. Okay. <laughs> then the third element that we need to work with is the fire element okay the third element that we need to work with is the fire element and the mantra is om vishnave namaha okay om vishnave namaha all right om vishnave namaha now i made a mistake with the second element the air element it is not om namah shivaya it is om shivaya namaha okay i'm really sorry i messed that up so the first element is the air uh, is the space element and the mantra is Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. The second element is the uh, space element. Sorry, the second element is the air element and that is no, that is Om Shivaya Namaha. The third element is the fire element, which is Om Vishnave Namaha. Okay, then we have the water element and the mantra is Om. Dum Durgae Namaha. Okay. Om Dum Durgae Namaha. That is the water element. And finally, we have the earth element, which is 
Ganesha. That is Om Gam Ganapataye Namaha. The mantra for the earth element is Om Gam Ganapataye Namaha. Okay. And finally, we have the mantra that will set your ascendant in order. And that is Om Shri Ramaya Namaha. Okay. Om Shri Ramaya Namaha. Om Shri Ramaya Namaha. Okay. So those are the mantras that, you know, these are the mantras that you need to do. Okay. Take a Rudraksh Japa Mala and do one mala each of all the mantras. Okay. Just to put things in perspective, the first element that we need to work it with is the space element. And uh, that is Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Then we have the air element, which is Om Shivaya Namaha. Then we have the fire element, which is Om Vishnave Namaha. Then we have the water element, which is Om Dum Durgaye Namaha. Then we have the earth element, which is Om Gam Ganapataye Namaha. And finally, we have the mantra for the ascendant, which is Om Shri Ramaye Namaha. Okay, Om Shri Ramaye Namaha. The ascendant represents your truth. So we all have our own truths within ourselves. And when we accept that truth, when we recognize that truth, life becomes pretty much beautiful. That is the logic or that is the beautiful, you know, logic that is associated with, with the mantra for the ascendant. Okay, so try this thing out. As I said, it needs to be done every Amavasya for 41 days. So if you are someone who is watching this video a few days after, you know, after it has been broadcast on YouTube, you can wait for the next Amavasya to start with this remedy. Okay, so do start with it. I'll write down the mantras in the description box so that it becomes easier for the people who are not familiar with Sanskrit. Okay, I write the English iteration of the mantras. And if you have a desire to get your chart analyzed, or if you want to consult regarding your chart, you can always reach out at the number given in the description box. Okay, so that's it from me in this video. I again take this opportunity to convey my regards on Shani Jayanti. Try out this remedy, as I said. And I'll see you soon in my next video. Om Gurave Namaha. Namaste.